Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. We did it again, man. We got another one. We got some more fire for y'all today, man. We got the University Blue Air Jordan 4s, man. And these are these are a lot doper than I expected. I'm gonna be honest, man. These are real dope. So uh, we're gonna get right into it. Uh, so this is my first day with Invisalign. So pardon me. I'm gonna have a slight lisp <laughs> throughout this whole video, man. I'm still getting used to talking with these things in my mouth. So uh, just bear with me on that, man. But we're gonna get right into it. Let's check these things out, man. And see if it's worth it. All right, so these things did drop today. Uh, this is Wednesday, what, April 28th? Yeah. April 28th, man. Uh, kind of a weird day for Jordans to drop, but every now and every now and then, uh, Jordan brand does drop on a random weekday. Uh, sometimes it makes for an easier cop just because uh, it's not as crowded as you know the weekend crowd and everything like that. But sometimes it makes it a lot harder. But it kind of just depends on the shoe. Uh, this shoe was speculated to have a lot more stock than you know what uh, was seemingly had. Uh, that seems like that's been a uh, you know consistent story with uh, Nike and Jordan brand, uh, especially in the past year with the pandemic and everything like that. But let's get into it, man. So right off the bat, as you can see, uh, let me get my uh, my name and number off that. So crazy way I won these, man. So I actually won these from finish line. Well, initially I didn't win on the finish line app. So I did the finish line raffle, right? I put in about six or seven extra reservations and somehow still didn't hit on finish line. But yesterday, Tuesday, I get a random call at like six o'clock at night. I'm thinking like, who's calling me? I almost ignored the call, but I was like, someone told me just pick it up. I pick it up. She's like, hey, da, 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 it's blah, blah, blah from finish line. Uh, we ended up getting some extra pairs. We got the uh, size nine that you put in the raffle for. Do you still want it? I'm like, yeah, like, yeah, I want to run that. <laughs> so I ended up, you know, confirming right then and there. She just told me to bring my ID in today. So that's what I did, and I grabbed them, man. But uh, right off the bat, as you can see, Jordan Brand did hit us with a, a little special box, you know, a little something, something. I always do appreciate when they do, you know, jazz up the box. You are spending, you know, 200 plus dollars almost every time. So it's nice when they at least, you know, put some thought and consideration into the packaging. But as you can see, man, we got a glossy top. Oh, <laughs> we got a shiny top on the box, man, with the baby blue, Carolina blue, Air Jordan up there. And then flight written at the bottom. Um, yeah, man, and the spickle spackle, you know, spickle box that's classic for Air Jordan 4s. Getting right into it, we got the Carolina blue under here. Um, I don't see the uh, the red lot tag, doesn't look like this pair has it. These are some pressure. This is a size nine. This is not my personal size. Um, I didn't go for my personal size. I wasn't thinking that I needed a personal pair of these. I mean, I'm gonna be debating. We're gonna see if I need a personal pair of these. These are a lot cleaner than I had, uh, that I had thought, man. The pictures definitely don't do these justice. Uh, this is a complete different vibe in hand than uh, what I thought it was gonna be. But uh, it just reads University Blue, Black, uh, Air Jordan 4 Retro, USD $200, nothing crazy, standard, standard. But let me put them out there. And there we have it, man. 
the University Blue Air Jordan 4 in all their shining glory. Man, like I just said, man, these things are some pressure, bro. Pressure, pressure. Now, obviously, you know, I'll get right into everyone's, you know, first initial gripe with the shoe is this, uh, this tag. That's the only thing that's different, you know, from normal Jordan 4s. They added this tag. I really don't know why. I guess, you know, supposedly they're trying to differentiate it from, uh, <laughs> differentiate, differentiate these from the, uh, the PE, the, uh, uh, UNC PEs. But I mean, I didn't think these were going to look like them at all because I didn't see the quality of the suede being this good. But now I kind of see why they did throw these on because the quality of this suede is actually like it's actually really fire. It's not super low. It has a slight shag to it, which actually, you know, kind of enhances the, the look of the quality at least. I don't know if it is actually better quality, but it looks like it's a more premium suede, which uh, obviously adds to, it, to the uh, aesthetic of the shoe. But overall, man, uh, the shoe has a whole bunch of classic elements, but uh, let's get right into it. So we got this university blue going all across the upper of this shoe, uh, just punching you right in the face pretty much. Uh, all over, except for the accents of the shoe are university blue, even on the, the netting here, the plastic netting and under the netting as well, all university blue with uh, some black hits right here in the lace holders and then some uh, cement gray hits with black splatters on the heel tab as well as the uh, the wings of the Jordan 4s and I uh, can't forget the, the midsole as well um, so those those accents are actually really dope on this shoe uh, they pop out pretty nicely and they're nice neutral colors so allowing you to kind of stick with the, the university blue being the main colorway of this shoe i know while uh, the travis scott fours they have heavy accents of red which you know kind of take away from the university blue aspect which makes it a whole you know different shoe when you look at it uh, i'll put a picture up here kind of demonstrating uh the point i'm trying to make but uh they definitely favor each other in terms of colorway obviously because the main color of them both same color blue um shades might be a tad bit different but overall you're getting a similar aesthetic at the fraction of the cost those are hitting for a thousand plus right now at the moment these about 350 dollars and uh you can lace you up a pair man but uh that's pretty much all the all there is to it man like i said university blue all over a few different accents the bottom of the shoe, black mud guard here uh, with some cement gray at the toe cap. Uh, well, the bottom of the uh, the toe in news, uh, all the stars are gray and everything too. Standard, standard Jordan 4 outsole, nothing crazy there. Everything regular, regular. Uh, nothing overly crazy or different about this shoe. It's just a different colorway we haven't seen before. Uh, what the general public hasn't seen before. Only people that have seen this colorway are the ones that received, you know, PEs at uh, UNC. Uh, those are also pretty similar to these, but uh, again, those definitely have a whole different uh, <laughs> grade of suede. I don't know bars, man. Those definitely have a whole different, uh, whole different quality aspect to them because uh you can definitely even see it in pictures the way that suede the way that suede is these uh this way definitely does have some some backstroke motion um you do see uh the color shift when you you know move your finger across the suede which is always a good sign uh let you know you're dealing with uh decent quality uh got your regular air jordan on the back of the tongue there standard standard stuff man uh like i said everything pretty regular man i'm not gonna keep you guys too much longer just wanted to give you a quick look at these fours um let me know if you guys struck out today let me know if you guys copped 
uh, I mean, I just cop these by the skin of my teeth, man. Like, I couldn't really go too hard trying to cop them this morning because I was at work, but we had a pair locked down, so I wasn't worried about it, man. I wasn't too worried, knowing I at least had a pair that I could uh, bring to the gym. Like, comment, subscribe, all of that, man. Tons of fire on the way, tons more videos on the way. Peace.